I don't know what the dream portends. Our lands were once peaceful, but it is now dangerous to travel far from home. While you tread the paths of Enloch Moy, do not keep your eyes upon your feet. These fair arbors and gardens recall the grandeur of my kingdom's past. I have walked them many times since my youth, and to remember them is the sweetest respite. I ask that you take note of the loveliest sights you see here. When you return to me, you may recount them, and so I will rele relive the pleasure I knew through your fresh eyes. All right. So. Talk to her advisors and find some paths. See what happens. Well, I suppose I should slow down a bit if I'm going to be looking for these paths. There's some nice fountains here. This town must be reasonably well protected if the children are still here and not evacuated. But then I suppose there aren't too many places for people to evacuate to right now because all those places are pretty much full at the moment. Well, we can only hope that this place is well guarded because unfortunately many of the places have sent their best soldiers out to Minas Tirith. Now. Oh. Places all over. Let's see, where is the... Ooh, this is a nice shot. Clear water laughs loudly as it spills into the central fountain. Ancient arches peer from the behind flower-laden trees. It came the right time of year to see flower-laden trees. Soon the flowers will be shed and turn into leaves. Hello, Captain. How are things doing here? How may I help you, friend? Lady Valens wishes to know the mood of the people. That is why Elmlock Moy will thrive even in the absence of Lord Forlong Pineleaf. What ruler cares as much about her people as Lady Valenos? Very few, I wager. When you return to her hall, please bring my assurances that we keep a good watch on all who approach the Vale. Nothing is threatening Elmlock Moy without me hearing it first. All right. This darkness is a weight on my mind. Most of the warriors have been called away to war, and the few recruits that remain are young and untested. Our master at arms, Hathron, has his hands quite full try trying to turn these boys into fighters. I know he could use your help, Heinleaf. The sparring circle is high above us, northwest of Lady Varner's Hall. Find Halathan and offer your services, and I know he will make use of your skills. Imlach Moy needs as many warriors as he can, even if she has to make them herself. All right. Very well. What else have we got around here? More. Else of interest around here? Of course, I hope I'm not leaving. No, this looks like we're still within the town here. I just don't know the pulse and bones and feel of it yet. And by the time I start to learn my way around here, ah, it's 
a cool shaded path that branches as a pine seem to whisper. Things long not for this. And pines are nice. Pines are really nice. Likely the river spirit is still trying to calm down after that little episode. Let us see what we have here. Hall of Gentle Hand. Gentle hand. Place of healing, I presume? Let's see, where is Brunio then? Am I supposed to... Brunio? Hey, this place is big enough to get... This is a real large place. This is just one hall. My my. I get lost? I can't even... I can't even keep my bearings inside of a... building. Quite a few number of people around here. But where is... Let's see... Where is Brunel? Oh, on the... Yeah, oh! Hmm. Sorry about that. Ah, you may be Brunel. Hello. Why do you interrupt me? Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I was sent by Lady Varanos. Lady Varanos sent you to ask after us? <sighs> the sick are sick and the well are weary. I would not expect a lady to come to these halls, but I suppose sending you shows that she at least she thinks of our so on occasion, toiling away for the health of her people. Tell her that we do what we can with less than we need, and if we complain, we do it only as a result of much hardship. Sorry. Why do you interrupt me? There are many demands upon my time, Pine Leaf, and I cannot be everywhere at, at needs me. I have spoken to the captain of the guard, but Mariner thinks I am jumping at shadows and will not look into this matter for me. Perhaps you can be my agent for this. It is my duty to heal the sick, but six, six of those in my care have taken turns for the worse beyond all reason. It is no chance, if you want one healer's opinion, they drink of the same mixture, but where it should have helped, it has not only hindered. I think some sneak has poisoned my medicine. Some lurking foe looks wrong to bring down the Hall of Gentle Healing and cast doubt upon my own abilities. Someone is lurking within or without the hall, and I need you to search for any possible hiding place for this villain. Well, that is troublesome. Hmm. That is very troublesome. Now, where? Would be a possible hiding place. How about some looking behind this bookshelf, maybe? Uh, no, nothing. 
nothing there. All right. That was a long shot, I know, but we must check all possible avenues. Anyone in here? No. Okay, there was someone there, but it didn't look like anyone suspicious. All right. Anything around here? Another one? Hiding in there? No, no one there. No, no, just someone trying to heal, looks like. down around here. Oh, hang on. What is this? What is this? Nothing suspicious. This thing is turned on its side. We need nothing suspicious. Well, mm, maybe. Well, if there was something suspicious there, they have left. Well, let's see if there's any place outside where they may be, where someone may be lurking. But where? Where would someone lurk? Hmm. Maybe in the bushes here? Anyone down there? No, nothing there. Well, what about... Down this way. Oh, hold on. Wait, what? Yeah, how about there? Ah, that was close to the road, so perhaps maybe that was a bit stretch. So what about any place here? Oh. Mm, well, let's see. How about here? No, I guess not. I didn't see anyone. I suppose that if anyone is around, well, I don't know this town very well, so it's possible I missed a couple of spots. But I didn't see anything out of sorts. So I will report what I didn't find. And she's not going to be happy, I know. She, she's crossed very easily. She's overworked, most likely. I suppose if you're overworked you. Alright. I haven't seen anything. What is the meaning of this? Yeah, I know. Nothing unusual. Well, you have my thanks for conducting the search anyway. Melanor did not even do that. I beg your pardon. I do not question the effect efficacy of your search pilot. I think the true problem here is that our sneak must be even more stealthy than I supposed. I think perhaps I have gotten ahead of myself. We need to ask the right questions, and I think we should start with the most basic of all. If I wanted to poison the healing draft, how would I go about doing it? Why, I would taint one of the components that goes into it. I have collected the ingredients that go into the mixture, and I give them to you. Will you take this to the field beneath the long stairs in the northern area of town and feed them to the goats we have there one by one? I think the goats will tell us if one of those ingredients is tainted. I don't think the goats will appreciate that. Alright. 
And I'm sure the goats won't appreciate it. I am definitely sure the goats won't appreciate it. Spear flower to one of the goats in the garden. Mm, well, of course, if... That's assuming that it's the spear flower that was tainted and not some other ingredient. Uh, the question is, how would we know if the goat gets sick? I mean, goats aren't exactly known for the weak constitution, right? Hmm. River Uri courses swirly to great arches, crashing in a great waterfall to the south. Alright. Well, I found that at least. Ah, uh, where do I find the goats? Maybe up this way. Alright, somehow I have a feeling this is not going to do anything. But we will have to see. Up this way. Ooh. Mm. She's sending me all the way across town for this. Mm. Well, what do you expect? get down there. Well, that's, that's just a fountain. Ah, here we go. And... Oh, goats. Actually, I think this way, right? I think I heard the sound of goats down here. At least she didn't ask me to feed it to Jaff. I wouldn't have accepted. I wouldn't have done that. They think they're poisoned. All right. Oh. What do we have here? Ah, here's a goat. Hello there. <laughs> Would you like something to eat? The goat readily eats the herb out of your hand. Sound too much of a problem. Hello, would you like something to eat? All right, well. Hello. Would you like something to eat? Ooh, well, that wasn't good. Fortunately, yep. goat constitution. Fortunately, well, glad I didn't give that stuff to Jazz. <laughs> All right, now where was I? This way. Ooh, something about I was told to find a stairway, right? Tall stone on the steps or something like that. Ah. Blossom River and Stonework alike are watched over by the slope. Alright. Ah.
and I seem to have found Hathron, who I'll speak with in the next episode of Pineleaf in Gondor.